Okay, so yun guys ha, final na yun. Next meeting naman, we'll talk about the presentations. Good night, stay safe. It's been over 10 months now since the onset of the lockdown brought about by the COVID-19 pandemic. And this has been the center of Aubrey's daily routine in these dark times. It's most important to keep track of the latest happenings on COVID-19 cases. Keeping yourself informed is being one step ahead in battling the virus. As we look after our own health, we must not forget to do the same for other living things. Through Aubrey's choice to walk, she is not only exercising but also being considered of the environment. Oh, ang get. Kumusta? No physical contact. There are many alternatives in greeting a loved one without physically touching them, especially during this health crisis. Anyway, I have to go get groceries. It was nice seeing you. Sure will. Keep safe, keep safe, Brie. Remember to write on the logbook before entering any establishment. Disinfect, especially when you had contacts with objects that are frequently touched. A safe distance away from people. When going back home after being exposed outside, be sure to wash your hands, dump your clothes in the laundry, and take a bath to make sure that you and your family is safe from what you may have gotten outside. Indeed, the struggles we collectively try to combat has been seemingly the biggest storms we've ever seen. The kind that's insurmountable. But if we have something that will make us weather these all out, it is our strong faith, helping hearts and determined minds to continuously heed to health protocols, remain safe, and eventually totally fight off this COVID-19 pandemic. Just always remember to observe especially the wearing of masks and face shield, social distancing, and basic disinfection. During this pandemic, always try to remain empathic. Your well-being is our well-being, so take care and be aware.